What is up, Trommeler Nation? I'm your host, Keller Keemstar. Let's go right into the news. Last night, Bryce Hall and Stromedy actually had a boxing match. And listen, dude, it was top secret. No cameras were allowed in to film it. Bro, leaks were coming out left and right. I've been working this story nonstop. I interviewed Bryce Hall, and we got that interview for you. I interviewed Stromedy, and we got that interview for you to try to figure out who won, and they're both saying that they won. So I interviewed a third party that was there that witnessed the entire thing. We got that for you too. And Drum Alert has exclusive fight footage we're gonna play for you. So let's jump right into it first. This is what Bryce Hall had to say about Bryce Hall versus Stromedy. Roll it. Ladies and gentlemen, we have the one, the only Bryce Hall on the line and you fought Stromedy finally. <laughs> Now, listen, yep. there's so many conflicting reports out there right now because no one's seen yeah. the footage. You did show me a little bit of footage. Who won this fight? It was very clear that I won, um, but I did not get the knockout. I didn't get the result that I wanted. So in my head, like just that alone is a loss to me. But 100% if it went to a second round, I would have ended it like with a with a knockout 100 now i talked to stromedy's team and, and they said that he got uh like two or three nice clean shots on you is that true uh no he got one clean jab on me and that was uh that's what i showed you right right i did see that footage and you were like that's all you got <laughs> now, yeah you were telling me on the phone when these first reports came out that stromedy won you were telling me that you were constantly just beating them up on the ropes and they kept breaking it up multiple. How many times did that happen? Six times. And then the rest of the time uh, was him running away in the ring. Now, why why are him and his people saying that he clearly won? Like, wh what Because is they're a group of trolls. <laughs> so I, I did a uh, FaceTime with you and I posted on Twitter that I was talking to you and you said that you won. You do have a shiner uh, over, uh, I believe your right or left eye. And uh, yeah. a lot of people think that's from Stromedy, is it? No, it's not. I, I literally had a sparring session with a pro boxer yesterday with no headgear, and we went three rounds for three minutes. I mean, like three, three minute rounds. And uh, he gave me that. We were exchanging. It's just weird. When I was fighting Stromedy, it's it's a lot harder to fight someone that can't fight uh, rather than an actual boxer. One, because you're training to fight someone that can fight. So when you're fighting someone so outlandish and unorthodox, it was just really weird. I've never had someone like run around the ring like that. But uh, I was connecting. His knees buckled two times throughout the whole entire fight. Uh, if it went to a second round, he knows he would have got knocked out. He was gassed after the first round. I could have went six more after that. <laughs> What was his uh, excuse for not going another round? Uh, he knew going into that that he was going to lose. You could tell by his demeanor and, and everything. He knew that he was going to take the L, and it was quite apparent that he did. But uh, my intentions were to get the knockout, and I'm pissed that I didn't in the first round. Um, I was under the impression that we were doing a three-minute round, but it was actually only two minutes. So it was only like a two-minute round, and I didn't get the the knockout. And 45 seconds of it is him running away from me in the ring. The whole world is on edge, right? Because nobody has seen this footage. When are we going to see this footage? It's coming out 100% on Saturday on my channel. Now I did talk to. And Str I'm not. And I'm not. And I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna like. I'm obviously gonna cut out because my vlogs are short. I'm gonna cut out a lot of the boring parts and him running away the entire time. But I am gonna show the the one hit that he got. And you clearly see, I say, is that really all you got? And then I'm gonna show a few of the times, not all of the times that he was just on the ropes getting wailed on and then being split up because there were six different times. There's gonna be controversy with that, right? With, with you editing that footage, there's gonna be people out there, especially Stromedy saying that you, you're you gonna edit the footage in a way that makes you look like you won. How, how are you gonna deal with that? I will show the beginning and the ending of everything. His demeanor is just, not there. You, you could tell he lost. Now, after this footage comes out, if this controversy keeps going between you and Stromedy, would you would you ever spar him again? Yeah, I'm down to do like a like a full live stream, but more more than a, a two minute round, preferably. And I, I'm, I'm before, shocked before, my, myself. I'm, go ahead. I'm shocked to myself that I didn't knock him out. 
<laughs> now, are you willing to do that before your fight with Austin or after? Oh, before. Interesting. It's just close, Interesting. closer closer to the fight, obviously, but I, I just don't want Austin's team studying how I'm sparring right now. I'm, I'm still new to boxing. I am a fighter. I, I can take someone's head off. I have knockout power for sure. You can see the the two times that he gets buckled, and, I, and these this is with headgear. Yeah. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we have the one, the only, Stromedy on the line. Stromedy, you got to help me out, man. I got early reports that you have won this fight with Bryce Hall. This one round, you won it clearly. And then I talked to you. You definitely said you won it. And then I talked to Bryce. He said he won it. Bryce showed me some footage, which looks like, you know, he may have had the upper hand on you. Of course, I didn't see all the footage. I seen bits and pieces. What happened? Why is yeah, there... Yeah, so that's, that's the thing, dude. We got into an altercation at the start because they weren't letting our team come in with our cameras. Meanwhile, his, his whole team was filming everything. So I don't know why we weren't allowed to film our perspective. We would have had the full raw footage for you right now. He's obviously going to chop it up and make it look in his favor. But, I mean, I'm not going to sit here and claim any victory, but everyone who was there knows what they saw and they can share their opinions on the fight. Most people are saying that I won. Um, but, yeah. Dude, I mean, you're that's... you're all the people around you are saying you won. I was on the phone with you. Uh, yeah. You had your coach there. You had all those people there. They were saying that you won. Uh, you know, I heard a, th a third source told me that you got a clear shot on him. Bryce admitted in the interview here on Drum Alert that you got a nice, good uh, jab on him. And he actually showed me that footage. Oh, really? That's all I got? <laughs> uh, yeah. and, and he guaranteed that that punch would make it in the footage that he puts out, but he says that he has to edit it. Thoughts on that? I mean, yeah, I don't know why he would edit it. Why wouldn't he just throw the whole raw fight up there? But yeah, I even overheard his coach saying like, um, like, yeah, dude, what the hell was that? Like, you can't give, you can't give me that kind of performance in the Austin fight. Ooh. Like even his coach said it was a draw, dude. Even his coach was saying, one guy on my team say they overheard Bryce telling their guys to delete that footage. So I'm not going to confirm that that's 100% true, but that's what I'm hearing too. So Bryce himself deleted the footage? Because I can tell you Bryce has the footage. I seen it myself. Yeah, I don't I don't really know, but I, I, that's what I heard. Like, I heard people saying that. But yeah, dude, like... Once well, who again, else like, was I'm, filming? Who, who else was filming? If you just weren't... Just Bryce's team. Like, no, we weren't allowed to film at all anything. Like, we came in with our cameras and... Uh, his whole team like bombarded us and was like, nah, 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 you can't film, you can't film. This is for Bryce's video, Bryce's documentary. Like, I don't know why he wouldn't allow us to film. Well, we know, our side. we know there. Were, who else was there? Because I know Fousey was there. He kind of like set this whole thing up, right? Yeah, pretty much. Was Fousey filming? Like, who? <laughs> uh, I don't, I don't know. Uh, I know Austin um, or uh, Alex. Uh, wasabi was there obviously my trainer <laughs> yeah and dude another thing is too is like if the footage comes out you're gonna see like he was throwing a a, a crazy amount of fouls like he would have been losing a lot of points like at one point dude he was just trying to wrestle me like it wasn't even a boxing match i did anymore. see that <laughs> he picked... dude he was just trying to throw me around the ring and, like it didn't even turn it wasn't even a boxing match anymore I did see him pick you up and put you into the ropes. He did show me that footage. Yeah, I, like that's how he was getting me into the ropes. Is that's that's about it. Now wait, I, I need you to confirm one thing real quick before I let you go. Bryce has a mark on, on the top of one of his eyes. Did he have that before he fought at you or after? Uh, I would assume he had that after because I did not see him with uh with that before. Cause he said he he says he's been sparring like pros or whatever, and that's where he got nah, the shine from. I gave that. I, I gave that to him. You're gonna see the punch where I gave that to him, and he got dazed, dude. And he was like, "Is that all you got?" Trying to buy himself time. Oh, really? That's all you got? <laughs> There's gonna it's be a to go lot over. of controversy with this Stromedy versus Bar Bryce Hall. Like, did you give him the shiner or not? Who won? Why are we not seeing all the footage? Like mm -hmm. this is never gonna end. So I just I, I just want everyone to know that if the footage is chopped up, then it can't be taken as the legit footage. We need the raw 
unedited, unchopped up footage. Like, if what what does he have to hide? If he was so good and he thinks he won, what does he have to hide? R drop the raw, uncut footage. Ladies and gentlemen, you heard it there from Stromedy. But before we let you go, Stromedy, mm. he says he's down to spar you again before he fights Austin. Are you down? I'm down to do it again, yeah. Why didn't you do two rounds with him? Uh, just because we agreed to one round. So I just gave him the one round. So and if, I you're him, down to you spar wanna... if you're down to spar him again, will you give him three rounds? Yeah, I would give him three rounds. Ladies and gentlemen, we've heard from Bryce Hall. We've heard from Stromedy. <laughs> it's a debate. Who won? Well, we have a third party that was there that witnessed this fight. Alex Wasabi on the line. Alex, who won? Oh, man. He's trying to put me on the spot. This is, <laughs> this is It's a tough decision. I'm not a judge. I'm not a boxing judge, but... I could just tell you the facts of what happened, what I saw with my eyes. And what I saw is that nobody went down. It was competitive. Uh, respect to both sides for even getting in the ring in the first place. Uh, I, Bryce was definitely the more aggressive fighter. Who was on the ropes more? Stromedy was on the ropes more. But if I'm being honest, the cleaner hits came from Stromedy. But the, but but the, but they both landed hits. But the thing is, Stromedy did land some good hits, but he turned his back a lot. And when you turn your back in a professional fight, the ref would call it right there and be like, "Oh, he gave up. That's a sign of giving up." So luckily, he was just sparring, and uh, they just broke it up and let him keep fighting. Well, Bryce said that um, they broke it up six times. Is that true? They did break it up a lot because Bryce kind of like he was like kind of like bombarding him so he was like coming at him hard so uh but why he break it getting... up because he turned his back and you can't hit uh... somebody when yeah you can't like no rabbit punches in the back of the head or the back of the body or so they have to break it up to let him turn around and bryce, continue the fight bryce keeps saying that stromedy was out of gas after the first round and he refused to do a second is that true was stromedy done so the thing is Yes, that's 100% true. If it went to the second round, Bryce would have 100% won. But Stromedy, he knew his limits. That's why he only agreed to one round. He knew that he wasn't going to be able to make it to the second round. So he he did. He was a man of his word. He did the one round, and that's and, and that's why if he went to the second round, Bryce would have would have definitely beat him just stamina wise. Alex, what are your final what are your final thoughts on all of this before I let you go? I I think that. Bryce sparred someone that doesn't have the greatest boxing status. So maybe Austin should spar someone like me who also doesn't have the greatest boxing status and see what he can do. Yeah, Alex, you should oh. fight him. <laughs> That's my I girlfriend. Know, I'm not fighting you. Uh, I, I, I wouldn't recommend that they fight me because they have their event coming up. But uh, if they wanted to, I'm down. Me and Austin are both family-friendly channels. We got zero fights. Uh, we're <clears throat> similar ages, similar height, similar weight. If you wanted to spar... Alex, are you I trying to down. say that you'd beat both Stromedy and Bryce? Uh, yeah, and Austin, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to have to leave it right there. Thanks, Alex. Thanks for coming on.